prepare. Amen. Lord, we worship you once again. I want you to begin to invite the Holy Spirit to come and take preeminence. Holy Spirit, I welcome you. I welcome you. There is no one like you. No one is as like you. No one is like you, Lord. There is none like you. No one can do what you have done, awesome God. Father, there is no one like you. I welcome you, Holy Spirit. I welcome your awesome presence, Lord. I welcome you this hour. Come and have your way. Come and take preeminence, Father. Come and take preeminence, Lord. Come and take preeminence, Lord. We welcome you, O Lord. We welcome you, Holy Ghost. We welcome you, Holy Spirit. We welcome you, Father. Have your way in the name of Jesus. Have your way, O Lord. Have your way, Jesus. Father, I pray, release your angels into different homes. Father, release your angels into, every, oh Lord, onto, into cities to locate your children wherever they are, in their business places, in their marriages, in their schools, in their destinies, where whatever that are troubled them, Father, give solution. The hour have come for deliverance. Lord, release your angels to destroy every power that are standing to contend with your children. Father, contend with those power. In the name of Jesus, Holy Spirit, arise. Holy Spirit, arise. Oh Lord, arise. Father, I welcome you. Come and have your way, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. Wherever you are, I know some of you might have been at work in this different business area, but I want you to connect, connect, and there is power. Jesus said, prayer is the key. He started with prayer and ended with prayer. Prayer is the master key. Sometimes you pray. Why this fasting is very important for you to take it serious. Wherever you are, no matter the church you are worshiping, but I would believe that God wants to use this praying and fasting to do something in your life. As my friend in Facebook, I have find it, you know, that is needful to share this moment with you. As my beloved friend, as a Christian, as a child of God, as you know, because there are some people who you might have not accepted Jesus. But I want to tell you that Jesus is the only thing you need in your life. He is the only thing that so, so, that solution that you are seeking for, for that trouble, that problem, that challenges that you are facing in your family. Jesus is the only way. He's the only way that he is the only one that will give you the solution you are seeking for. He said in the book of Matthew, chapter 11, verse 28, Come unto me, all he that rebel and heavy reading, I will give you rest. So he will give you rest. If you come unto him, he will give you rest in the name of Jesus. So I want us to go down to the word of God. Then we continue with our prayer this morning. Why I want to tell you the reason why this prayer is important. You know, seven days, as it's been titled, seven days fasting and prayer. The theme of this prayer is operation. Take your destiny by force. You have you will take your destiny in your hands because if God may pronounce and promise you have a glorious destiny. But if you don't pray, if you pray with you, if you if you if you keep silent. Enemies that will rob you of what belongs to you. Even if you in the physical, you can see people they have they have taken you know what belongs to them. Because maybe you, you are a young man, you, you have you don't have money, but you see someone that you love. Because of money, another man will come and take it, take her away from you. In some people, their land have been taken away. Many things that belong to them have been taken away because of physical. You know, the Bible says money answering all things. Wisdom is the principle of all things, but money answering all things. Hallelujah. So you, you need money to succeed. You need money in your life. You need breakthrough. Hallelujah. You in as much you need Jesus. So if Jesus is that the way to your success. You need him. So at this hour, we need to take our destiny in our hands. Hallelujah. If you read the book of Matthew chapter 11 verse 12, he said, Since the day of the John the Baptist until now, the kingdom of God suffering virus and the virus take it by force. Therefore, you don't need to sleep again. You need to be awake. You need to be fervent in prayer. Hallelujah. The kingdom of God suffering virus, but only the virus take it by force. 
So the topic I want to share with you this moment, I title it War Against Destiny, uh, uh, Destiny Destroyers and Spiritual Arm Robbers. Hallelujah. What did I mean by this? War Against Destiny Destroyers and Spiritual Arm Robbers. If you read the book of Daniel, the book of Daniel chapter 10, verse 12 to 14, I will read. Then, then he continued, Do not be afraid, Daniel, since the first day that you sat, you set your mind to gain understanding and to humble yourself before your God. Your words were heard and have come, and I have come in response to them. But the prince of the Persia kingdom resisted me 21 days. Then Michael, one of the chief priests, came to help me because I was detained there with the king of Persia. Now I have come to explain to you what will happen to your people in future for the vision concerning a time yet to come praise the lord in, in those days daniel was praying he was praying because there was a war in the kingdom of the Babylon where they do it there was you know he prayed he prayed he prayed he prayed and he want to receive answer he want deliverance he want god help and he was committing seeking the face of god for over the challenges that they are facing and he want to see solution and as he started to pray his prayer reached heaven but some powers who is those power power from your father's side from your mother's side from the place you marry the place you are living the city you are living there are some power that does not want you to succeed even there are some evil friends when they see you succeeding they want to suppress you there are people who do a lot of prayer and incantation for you not to prosper. When they see you that you are escaping, they want to draw the clock of your life backward. They don't want you to succeed. They don't want to see greatness in you. They want to see you remain under, under them. They want to see you begging them for food. They want to see you suffering. But today, out of Mount Zion there shall be deliverance. It is your day of deliverance in the name of Jesus. It is your time, your hour of miracle. Those you, those chain is broken in the name of Jesus. If you believe, shout hallelujah. Masata karabababababa. The powers, the powers, the prince of Pesha, he sees the angel which they sent to deliver the, the answer to the prayer of Daniel. What is that power? Standing. Sometimes you dream, you see yourself in your village. What are you doing in your village? You see yourself wandering. Sometimes you see yourself, you dream that good thing is about to happen. But after set and done, nothing happens. You pray, you go a lot of churches, you go a lot of crusades, you have prayed, you have prayed. You see nothing happen. There are powers behind that. Powers that are standing when you are praying, they are standing. God will release the prayer, but they are standing. Hallelujah. That is why you need to pray more. Do not be weak in your spirit. Do not be weak. There are some powers also, every day and night, they are trying to destroy your spiritual life. They are always manipulating minds to make us not to walk according to the direction of God. When God is taking you, are you the direction you need to follow for you to succeed because that is why jesus is the way the way to our success the way to that road that reach to our miracle the way that you're supposed to follow that you will meet with your destiny helpers the enemy will divide your mind to the other way even sometimes to make us to take wrong decision master take care of child of god the, this is your hour of miracle every power manipulating your mind Every power assigned to manipulate your blessings, every power assigned to manipulate your prayers, I say, Holy Ghost, fire! Holy Ghost, fire! Holy Ghost, fire! Ma, rimbo, derebo, bobo, shente, keribos. The powers, powers work against destiny, destroyers, and spiritual and robbers. 
these are the spiritual animals that have the, the, the power of darkness devil and his agent they release to hijack the prayer of Daniel so also that is how they do to hijack prayers of Christians hallelujah sometimes you see yourself you are praying while praying you, you begin to wake you see yourself you are weak the hours are you supposed to wake you become weak you now begin to feel the spirit is waiting but the flesh is weak every spirit that assigned every evil serpent assigned to torment you to weaken you to torment you in the dream i command their head to be crushed by the sword fire of god in the name of jesus in the name of jesus in the name of jesus whatever power that have caged your womb that you will not conceive i command that power to be destroyed now in the name of jesus because children and inheritance that come from god it is if god said go into the world and multiply and replenish the earth is this one of the the those the hard desire of god to see us prospering to see us being fruitful i decree your fruitfulness now in the name of jesus it is the will of god that we shall reap in abundance it is the will of god that we shall reap without sickness he that do in the secret place of the most shall abide under the shadow of the almighty how we say of the lord you are my helper you are my defender in you i trust you are my fortress you are my shade the lord is our shade no sickness will hold you down in the name of jesus i decree child of god that no evil sickness we come near you in the name of Jesus. Coronavirus is not your portion. No evil disease. Are you facing any challenges now? I pray. Moka that sickness is not unto death. Receive your healing now. Receive your healing. Receive your healing in the name of Jesus. From your head to toe, if you are feeling sick, wherever you are feeling sick, I, I want you to hold your hand there in your stomach, wherever. I pray. Receive your healing. Hey, you sickness, you infirmity, you high blood pressure, Marco, you fat blood, you cancer. I command you out of that body in the name of Jesus. This body is a temple of God. Breathe, you have no power to occupy that body. I command you out in the name of Jesus. Every moving object, every evil arrow that they have assigned and pressed in your body, I command them out now. In the name of Jesus Christ, receive your healing, child of God. May brother, if you believe, shout amen like thunder. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Father, I worship you. Since the day of the John the Baptist, the kingdom of God suffered violence. Hallelujah. So we ask, I want to prepare your mind for prayer. We will call, we must pray. Prayer is the key. Jesus, he came, he do 40 days and 40 nights. He prayed and heaven opened and empowered him to undergo to achieve his destiny his destiny here on earth is to die for me and you to save us to save us from slavery to save us from imprisonment of the law now he give us grace we are operating by grace not by law anymore now you have freedom of speech now you have freedom to go wherever you want to make decision before you see some people there will be in one video they will banish them they will be there and they will be there you will say that they are, are outcasts but jesus came to set all the outcasts free we are free born through him hallelujah i want you to lift your hands your right hand to heaven say i am free indeed thank you jesus thank you jesus thank you jesus hallelujah 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 our god is the king of kings He's a Lord of Lords. He's a King of Kings. When we go to the book, the book of Ephesians, the book of Ephesians, chapter 10, chapter 6, verse 12. It says, 6, 12. For we are not fighting against human beings, but against the wicked spiritual forces in heavenly world the rulers and authorities and cosmic powers of this dark age so put on god's armor now then when the evil days come 
you will be able to resist the enemy attack. And after fighting to the end, you will, be, you will still hold your ground. You, I decree you shall be victorious in the name of Jesus. We are not fighting against flesh and blood. There are some spirits that operate through men. There's a spirit that devil used to manipulate men, you know, the heart of men. When God speaking, you will be you will speak also to confuse, to put confusion, to make you to make evil decision. Kaku karababa. To confuse, to put confusion in marriages. Do you see someone that's supposed to marry you? But before you know, problem will come up. The man, everybody will change mind. I don't want to marry again. You will remain there, time will be going. These are the powers of darkness that does not want marriage to settle. In the name of Jesus, I command destruction upon their kingdom. And I decree deliverance upon your life in the name of Jesus, child of God. We are not wasting against the flesh and blood, but against the spiritual forces in the heavenly places. The power that hinder prayer. When you are praying, that is why the, the word of God requires us that we should renew our mind. We should not be confirmed to the standard of this world. We should re renew, rate our mind be renewed, be refreshed with the word of God. Must be transformed by the renewing of our mind. That is the book of Romans chapter 12, verse 1 and 2 and 3. You know, living in the holiness and in righteousness, so, but because when there is a great power coming out of your mouth, it will pull out whatever siege they put in the sky to hinder your prayer. It will reach to heaven and it will bring down the power, it will bring down the answer, and you will see the manifestation of your prayer. Child of God, I want you this hour to begin to ask the Lord to fill you with his, the Holy Ghost, the power of the Holy Ghost. I want you to begin to ask for the power of the Holy Ghost. You might have undergone physical baptism by water, but you have not been baptized by the Holy Spirit. I want you to ask for their power. In the book of Acts, the apostles, they wait for the promise of the Holy Ghost, which Jesus promised us. He's our comforter. I want you to ask, raise that power be raised unto you. Heavenly Father, I worship you. Father, I give you all the honor. I give you all the glory. I ask for Lord for the empowerment of the Holy Spirit upon your children now. Upon my life, Lord, I need you more. Father, release your power. You release your spirit upon your children now. As many that are hearing the sound of my voice, they are still operating in their own. Father, I pray that they will need you. I pray, release your spirit upon them. Release your power upon them. Just as you do at the day of the Pentecost. Father, I want, oh Lord, Father, we need your power. I will need you, Holy Ghost. Father, release your power upon your children now to take over their life. To take over their life. Rate to take over their mind. Masokopori, brother, for directions. Father, Makoke, brother, da 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 da. You are our comforter, Holy Ghost. You are the one who direct us. You are the one who see all things. You are the one who speak to us. You are the one who reveal the secret of our enemies. Father, we need you, Holy Spirit. Father, send your spirit. Send your spirit. Send your spirit. Send your spirit. Reke teke 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 te. Maseteke mori, brother, da da da. For without whom we can do nothing. Holy Ghost, we need you. Father, we thank you. For in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. I want you to say, Oh Father, give me your grace. Give me your grace. I want to enjoy your grace. As a child of God, I don't want to live in struggle again. I don't want to live in my own power again. By struggle, no man can succeed. But by your grace, when your grace is upon a man, he will move with the speed. Just as it is in the case of Joseph, grace all around him. No matter what the enemy tried to stop him, you will become unstoppable, child of God. When the grace of God is upon your life, I ask, I want you to ask for grace this hour. The grace to carry speed, 
to move forward. Masete kere grace to live above limitations, grace to live above poverty, grace to live above above borrowing. Makaku kere baradada, you cannot be child of God and continue to borrow, continue to live in land and want. Reke pokori baradada, carrying sickness from year to year. The hour have come. Maku kere baradada, Father, I pray for your grace upon your children this hour. I pray for your grace upon my life. In my ministerial life, I pray for your grace upon my marriage. I pray for your grace, Lord, unto your children. This hour, as many hearing the sound of my voice, as many that are connected, O oh Lord, to this prayer. Repopori, Kata, child of God, open your mouth and pray. It doesn't matter the church you are going to, it doesn't matter where you are worshiping. What matters is that they, you shall receive your miracle. Repopori, Kata, Kata, da, 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 da. Masoto Kori Bradadada. Father, I ask for your grace upon these ones, upon these souls. Rebori Bradadada. Father, grace. Father, as there be call in your name. Father, in as, as your, your children. Father, I pray for your grace upon their life. Masoto Kori Bradadada. Remove every spirit of struggle in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Kaku Kori Bradadada. Father, I worship you. Thank you for raising grace unto us, O Lord, in Jesus' name, the spirit of grace, Father, unmerited favor, I give you praise in the name of Jesus. Amen. In the book of Isaiah chapter 54, 54 verse 15, let's see what he said. Bakuru, brada, da, 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 bribo, de, kete, keri, brada, da, 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 Isaiah 54, Isaiah 54, verse 15. Yes, I'm reading good news. If anyone attacks you, be, he does it does it without my consent. Whoever fight against you, we fall. Hallelujah. Mashata kara ba 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 ba. Reke teke teke. Thus say the Lord. Thus say the Lord. Thus say the Lord. Those whenever before anyone could attack you, except it's not by you no, know, they shall surely gather. But they are gathering because it's not of God. They shall scatter. They shall fall for your sake in the name of Jesus. I want you to pray, Oh Lord my God, any evil can go up in the spiritual camp of in the spiritual camps, in the covens, in the sea, in the covens of witchcraft, in the mari coven, any evil can go up of your enemy against your destiny, against to hinder your prayer. There are sometimes you pray, God, make me great. People will be there making evil prayer against you. Say, Lord, make, begin to make incantation for you to remain poor. Break all their evil incantation. All their evil gang up against you, scatter by fire, by thunder. Ask the Lord to say their camp of rage. Your prayer. Oh Lord, set the camp of my enemies of rage. Those that are gathering against me. Father, because your will is for me to prosper. But they are gathering against me for me to remain in one spot. They are gathering against me and my marriage to scatter. They are gathering against my ministry, my calling to be useless. I command that gathering today to scatter by fire. Because their gathering is not for you. I command them to scatter. Father, in, in the name of Jesus, any man or woman gathering against your children, gathering against these souls, these ones hearing the sound of my voice. Anyone under the sound of my voice, whosoever gathering against you, against your miracle, against your blessings, against your breakthrough, I command them to be destroyed. In the name of Jesus, I command their camp to catch fire now. All their gang, 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 ganging praises, every of their meeting praises, every hidden, all their hidden, hidden, every all their secret praises, wherever they are making their evil enchantment, I command it to be set abreast now to catch fire in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, Father. I worship you, I lift your name high. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Child of God, I want you there. So Someone that the parents, the enemy want to take your parents. I want you to pray. Lord, preserve the life of my parents. If you have, if you have parents, pray for your parents. Because it is the will of God that 
man shall reap, bear children. After all that he has labored, he will reap to eat the fruit of his or her labor. Any power that wants to take your parents on Tamiri, or as you are, you, you, you have children, you shall reap to eat the fruit of your labor. You shall not suffer in vain. You shall not suffer and another man will eat. You shall eat the fruit of your labor in the name of Jesus, your prayer. Father, I pray, pray, oh Lord, Father, as my viewers, I pray for their parents. Father, I pray, preserve their parents. Any power that want to take them on timely. Lord, I pray thee, Father, preserve them. I rebuke sicknesses out of their life in the name of Jesus. On timely, that is not their portion. In the name of Jesus, Father, I pray for your anointing over my life that I shall reap to eat the fruit of my labor. My wife shall reap to eat the fruit of her labor. In the name of Jesus, I pray unto you, in your all your endeavor, you shall reap to eat the fruit of your labor, child of God. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Masoto Kori Bradadagosh in Jesus' name. The grace to reap, to eat the fruit of your labor. Rest upon you now. In the name of Jesus. Receive it now. Father, I worship you. Holy Spirit, I give you all the glory. I give you all the honor. I give you all the adoration. Wherever you are, begin to pray the blood of Jesus upon your life, upon your marriage, upon your everything, upon all that concerns you. Breathe the blood of Jesus upon that your father's compound. I see someone that the enemy, they are operating against you through your father's compound. There are some evil uncle that does not want you to prosper. Sometimes you dash the money, but they use the money for another evil purpose against you. Reko take it, take it, take it. They're smiling with you, but there is not damn deep in their heart. I want you to pray. Every power from my father's company operating, operating, oppressing, and manipulating my glory, manipulating my progress in life. I command you to be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Ask them, Master, their time is up. Every evil power in my father's compound manipulating my progress. I command you to die by fire. You evil strong man, you evil strong woman, wherever you are, every witchcraft man, every witchcraft woman in my father's compound, in my father's shrinage, working against my progress, working against my miracle, working against my breakthrough, working against my rifting in life, repokori kadadada, die by fire, die by fire, die by fire, in the name of Jesus Christ. Yeri for in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Say, my Father, my Maker, O oh Lord, do not allow my blessing to pass me by. Your prayer, my Father, my Maker, O oh Lord, my God, do not allow my blessing to pass me by. Do not allow my blessing to pass me by. Father, I pray thee, any power in the air assigned to hinder my blessing, Assigned to hinder the miracle of my miracle, my wife miracle, my members. Father, I pray, raise those evil power, be arrested and be destroyed in the name of Jesus. I pray, let it release to our miracle. Father, let it come down. Let it come down. Let the manifestation of our blessing come down. Father, do not allow our blessings to pass us by. Do not allow our blessings to pass us by. Do not allow my blessings to pass me by. In the name of Jesus. Do not allow my blessings to pass me by. Open your mouth and pray, child of God. Oh Lord, my Father, do not allow my blessings to pass me by. King of kings, Lord of lords, send me your helper from above. Just as you sent forth, and Jemichael, he came in the rescue of Daniel. Mass prayers. Father, send the rescue to us, O oh Lord, now. Release our miracle. Release our blessings. Release our documents. Release our job. Release, O oh Lord. Release our good health. Hearing, O oh Lord, to those that are sick. Oh, in the hospitals in different homes. Lord, I pray. Release, O oh Lord, peace to those marriages. Peace, O oh Lord. 
those all are in the churches there is quale there is all of masa teke keke mi karababa dispute remo de kerebo de kerebo bos this unity i pray lord bring peace in the name of jesus ya karababa baba 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 reke teke 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 father do not rate my blessing to pass me by Father, as you are going around doing good, as you are going around blessing my, my all the people around me, Lord, bless me also. Bless me also. Bless me and my household. Bless me. Your prayer, child of God, pray. Oh Lord, do not rate your, oh Lord. Father, do not rate your blessing. Pass me by. In the name of Jesus. Father, I worship you. Thank you, Jesus. Right of God, right of the world. You came into the darkness. We are here to worship you. Father, I thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, King of Kings. Amen. For in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Repeat after me. O oh Lord, my Father, send forth the stone fire, your stone fire, into the camp of my enemies and destroy all evil enchantments against me. Your prayer. There are some keys, the ports they use to padlock destinies. Sometimes they bring your picture, they cannot put your picture in Facebook, in different media to use it to do evil against you. Any man or woman who have taken your picture, taken my picture for evil purposes, evil shall locate them and evil shall destroy them in the name of Jesus. I return back to send that anything they have do against you. Sometimes you wear your pass, enemy will take the sand of this, your foot to do evil. Whatever thing beyond to you that the enemy have taken in order to harm you, I command it to backfire in the name of Jesus. That is what you need to always let your heart be pure for others. Whatever thing they do against you shall backfire in the name of Jesus. Your prayer now, O oh Lord my Father, send forth your stone fire into the camp of my enemies and destroy all their evil enchantment against me. Every evil enchantment made against me, O Lord. Report in the covering in the shrine, the evil altars, any altar they are. Lord, I pray thee, send forth your fire, send forth your stone fire to hit their heads, to scatter that pot, to destroy that pot, to destroy wherever they, those keys which they have had rock. I raise your, I raise your destiny now in the name of Jesus. Every every shrine, wherever they are taking your name, wherever they have taken what belongs to you, in order to hinder you from prospering, I raise you, child of God. I raise your miracle now. I raise your blessings now. I raise your husband now. I raise your children now. I raise your job, miracle job, in the name of Jesus. I raise your breakthrough, that divine connection. I raise your destiny. In the name of Jesus, I raise your passport, I raise your citizenship, I raise whatever thing which you have been praying for, an enemy have hijacked it. That's Marco Caleb, I raise it now unto you in the name of Jesus. I stand as an oracle of God. Whatever he asked me to proclaim, I proclaim. I proclaim that it shall be well with you in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I worship you. Father, I give you all the glory. I give you all the honor. 